So I wanted to investigate the randomness of dice rolling in Tabletop Simulator. If you mouse over dice and press R for roll, the dice pops up into the air and supposedly lands on a random side. But sometimes you may have experienced that the dice just pops up and kind of doesn't fly very high or seems to land back on the same side. And I was wondering, is there really random number generation going on or is it just throwing it in the air, nudging it a little bit and relying on the physics to randomize it? I think I found that there's true random number generation going on with two different experiments. So watch as I navigate this video frame by frame and you'll see the dice pops up for a couple frames and then when it's just above the ground, it'll randomly rotate to another side. I think it's a jump and completely random. It continues to fly up in the air and then falls back down. Okay, so it's jumped up. Still, the six is still up, 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 boom. Immediate random rotation to an entirely different orientation. Up, 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 still six, two, and four, six, two, and four, six, two, and four, boom. Completely different orientation. Next one, up, 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 six, two, and four, boom. Completely different orientation. Up, 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 up. So that I think was it right there. That was the jump. This one, the orientation is still pretty similar, but that's random luck. Sometimes it is gonna stay pretty similar. Up, 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 boom. Completely new rotation. So I also stuck tons of dice, rolled them all, and did a statistical analysis to see if they're approximately equal results of one through, four, one through six. All right, so out of 155 rolls, this is our frequency distribution of getting a result of one, two, three, four, five, or six. And to me, it looks fairly random. Uh, I think what's especially important is all the dice started on the one face. And if, if it relied just on physics and they just popped up into the air and got nudged, I think we would actually have odds of one, you know, that but falling back down with the one side face up being higher than the others. And in this case, we definitely don't see the case. I'd probably need to do a thousand of these and run some statistical analysis to determine what 95% likelihood that this is truly a random distribution but this is enough for me uh plus the frame by frame data that there really is random number generation every time you use the r button in tabletop simulator one 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 one, one. bam random side one 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 bam random side